How do you feel about the influence that, that art has on people? Uh, the influence of art that has on the world, actually, is, is great. I mean, and is a necessary art, because without art, there's no culture. Without culture, there are, there's no nations, there's no style, there's no anything. People who, in governments who think art should be left to just private equity or private kind of funding is misinformed because every day people make artistic choices without even knowing it. When you put your outfit together, that's an artistic statement. It's color matches color or if it's style matches style. You do your hair in a certain way, that's an art. There's an art form of hair style. Everything is influenced by art, so art is necessary. That's why comic books, especially here we are at a comic book, is a great way to introduce young people, young minds, to art, to, to reading, to more out, you know, to morals and the moral story, to knowing about right and wrong. So when I when they say art, art can save the world. It can. The art can save the world. It's it's art that brings cultures. It brings music. It brings visual art. It brings the creative mind together. If we created more art instead of more bombs or weapons, we'd be a much greater place. So it's great to hear that you decided to change your way and go to to see movies and read. And, and watch things, listen to music, rather than get in trouble where a lot of kids have nothing else to do or can't afford to go and get comics or go and see a movie. But if they can create art, if they can create music, or if they can just create any type of visual or beautiful kind of artwork, it's an easier way of getting through life, I feel. You know, do you have any advice to maybe to maybe young creators or creators that may ha maybe haven't heard their own voice yet? Don't. Don't listen to the no's. There's enough people externally telling you no, or don't do that, or get a more stable job, or something more. Yes, money needs to be made to get you to feed yourself, put a roof over your head, and get you where you want to go. But at the same point, develop your art. You know, you may have doubts in your mind, like, should I really be doing that? Just do it. If you're a writer, just keep writing. Write things, have other people read your work, give you encouragement or give you critique in a positive way. Surround yourself with like-minded people. If you're an artist that likes to draw, find other folks that like to draw and you can hand, you know, feed off of each other's criticism. If you like to write, find a group of writers that like to write. If you're an actor or if you're a singer or something like that, singing group, find a band, find like-minded musicians. If you're an actor, find your local community theater group. Other actors and theaters always love helping out young talent and move up because we know the funding, especially in public school system, is drying up so quickly that the only way to get arts to be nurtured is by actually surrounding it and enveloping it. When you're seeing it, instead of people turning to more not so conventional ways of, of, of a lifestyle and, and whatever, you want to make sure you just nurture them and give them their artistic outlet. Because you don't want a violent outlet, because that's what happens. Some people, they're, they're not given attention or they're abused or whatever, and then violence can come from that. Or if they're oppressed, violence can come from that. But if you have an artistic you know, expression of some sort, find it like-minded people and stay that way. If you get involved in knuckleheads that want to drag you into another world just because of loyalty or whatever. Are you part of this clock? Are you part of this, this? You don't want that. Stay out, man. Stay out and do your thing. Don't, don't follow the no's, but the yeses. As long as you're not hurting anyone or pinching on other people's freedoms, follow your art. All right. Thank you so much. You are awesome. Good to see you. Thank you. That was really good, man. You're welcome.